I want to start my first thanking the Uganda Netball Federation for being very consistent with the program for the national teams. The national teams under 21 were due for the World Cup in Fiji, as well as preparing the senior national team for the Commonwealth Games, which is due in summer in Birmingham, England next year. We note the challenges of COVID, but nevertheless, government has located the Samsung of sports and we hope going forward this would be the big dream team to deliver us for the next World Cup, the Commonwealth Games, as well as the Under-21 Championship. So on behalf of the Honorable Minister of State for Sports, on behalf of the Chairman of Council, Council members, staff of Council, and on my own behalf, I want to take this opportunity to wish Team Uganda success in the test series in South Africa. I have been informed this test series is one among the many uh, competitions which will be used for Netball Africa to rank and get their best. And I note the current positions in the world ranking and African ranking uh, give us a contest. So our aim of going to South Africa is not to just present ourselves, but to show what we have. I note the good uh, competition which we posted in the Commonwealth in Australia in 2018. I also note the good uh, competition following the last World Cup in Liverpool, England. I note that there are new players who have come up and we want to take the space. So the challenge is in those ones who have been national team before, like Joan, <laughs> to note that these young tucks are here to cause you problems. So I want this to be more competitive on the side of the players, but also to give a team a good strategy to win all upcoming matches. I thank you. You should note that COVID is real, and wherever you go, you should not forget uh, COVID management is about self-control, it's about self-discipline. You don't need a manager to push you to put on your mask and where you are going, they have a history about COVID, which we must pre pre prevent ourselves against. I hope that the management team will be in control of the team and lastly, to observe that this team has been fully facil uh, facilitated by the government of Uganda we don't expect any problem in terms of your logistical requirements and being a test series, the focus therefore should be to post the best results and give the technical harm of the national team opportunity to see the gaps for the future coming championships. I thank you all and with the honor now, I officially flag off the team and hand over the national flag for Uganda the team captain. May God bless you. Amen. So I can pose also with the team. I can pose with the team. Yeah, we are leaving early according to COVID-19 protocols. We are supposed to go to the hotel once we arrive in South Africa for testing. After testing, we shall be in that same hotel for four days before we go out for the games or for training. So we shall be like quarantined for the four days. Yeah. Yes, uh, the team that we are taking has got new players, but these players are not that very new. Majority of them we are training with under 21. So they have that experience and the selection was good according to the coaches so it's a team we trust will deliver so ko twalo omukisa guno nganja yakwe baza national council of sports general secretary at flag in the off uh, unf president executive uh, press ne ba coaches 
on behalf of my team, my team captain, and to so we are called Vinci. However, much of the two are the Nabutono, nay to because this is a to Robert, no, not team to Quatagani de Wam to gain a color chaman in Nanchuka Chuka this time round. Um, engage Baba by day by seven Nabato to gain a Kulabanga, two one, nothing to Label, but to say. I really like I'm going to make really Yeah.